This video is to demonstrate the application of transvaginal uterine artery clamp to control bleeding from an atonic PPH. Imagine this is the model of the uterus with this representing the vagina and these are the lips of the cervix. These are the two clamps that we need. These are two sponge holders and these are the retractors. In case there is profuse bleeding from an atonic uterus, you first expose the cervix by retractors like that and then use a sponge holder to catch the anterior lip of the cervix and another one to catch the posterior lip of the cervix. Once the cervical canal is opened, you can take the right angled transvaginal uterine artery clamp insert one blade in the cervical canal and the other lateral to it and let it go up till it is prevented from going up by the lateral fornix. At that point, push deliberately up a little more and then clamp it. This will help to catch the uterine artery where it joins the side of the uterus. Repeat the same thing on the opposite side. One blade inside, the other laterally, go up and then again deliberately push up a little more and then catch it. This way, both the uterine arteries are occluded and blood supply to the uterus will be cut off. 